Sometimes, guys, on the internet, you see some strange things and some people post some strange things in your comments on YouTube. Welcome back, guys. This is the Raw Geek here. Yesterday, we're doing a slightly different video. It is October, so it's okay to do some spooky stuff more so than usual. And this may be offensive to some people in some ways. I mean no offence, it's just a very strange thing I want to show you. And I'm not going after this person. I don't want anyone else to go after this person. They've probably got some issues. But it doesn't mean I can't show you something which I think is quite bizarre. Now a few years ago I made a video of all of Bill Paxton's scenes in the brilliant movie Aliens. He was Private Hudson. I say all the scenes, it weren't exactly all of them, a few of them I had to cut because YouTube kept finding them with their algorithm and blocking the video worldwide. So the only way I could get it on there at all is by cutting out some of his scenes. But most of his famous lines were in the video and it's had over 200,000 views now. It, you know, it's quite a popular video. Now, there are of course going to be lots of comments on a popular video. and sometimes comments go into what's known as the spam so what YouTube determines as spam it puts them into that and doesn't publish them onto the video unless you look at them manually yourself and there was one comment that I only recently found actually was in the spam that made me just sort of read and, and I was like what? so let's take a look at that now so this is the spam part, I've only got nine currently at the moment because I've got rid of some more and some are actually genuine comments that I then you can tick to say you publish them. And this particular one, it starts off a bit strange, I wasn't sure if they're being serious, I think they are. And it says, remember this is on the Aliens video of Bill Paxton's scenes as Private Hudson, those aliens are an actual race. Our solar system was heaven once. Space is now the biblical abyss. <laughs> I worked with Yahweh's elite warriors, and that's how we found out. Yahweh taught us to destroy them with quartz crystals. This, <laughs> this movie was priming me for a work I began doing in 2010. These particular aliens live off the coast of California in the water. Here, <laughs> Here is a message we received from Yahweh God. And this is where it just descends into utter madness. Look how long this comment is. <laughs> it is just absolutely insane. So, let's read some of it. it. says, Yahweh God discusses dimensional quartz weapon, neutralized cell towers, makes plants grow. Yahweh commands all humans possess quartz, quartz weapon. AI and aliens, clones invasion, paranormal and dimensional, <laughs> dimensional merging. Yahweh calls them plasticine and revealed last year three of four humans are not humans. So guys, if you're having dinner tonight with your family or your friends or something, just remember that if there's four of you, at least all of them but you is actually not a human, unless you yourself are not a human, and then one of those people might be legit. But three out of four people have been replaced with non-human entities. Wow. <laughs> and then it goes into just loads of absolute nonsense. It quotes what looks like some kind of scripture from the Bible or something like that, but kind of just like, it, it seems manually changed. So it's not like they've just copied and pasted from something. They've manually changed it to make it kind of make sense of what the comment is, which is just crazy. Um, it starts going on about Lucifer and all this sort of nonsense. Uh, and it does start also putting in these, these sort of like links now and again. So if I go here, because this Sh Sherry Shriner, person so I'll go to this page and Sherry Schreiner did some kind of interview where she talks about that she spoke to Lucifer or something like that you know she's obviously older and then keeps going on about Geyser now for some reason 
and then this is where that sort of transcript we were just looking at I think this is the actual kind of interview that the lady who says she spoke to Lucifer did and it's on YouTube so they've linked me the YouTube so I had to go and have a look and it's called Daniel Ott interviews Sherry Schreiner and basically it's just it's just crazy she's written this book interview of devil with the devil which obviously she's trying to get sold I guess I think she's done a few books this guy kind of if you watch some of this, it seems like he's kind of trolling her. I don't. I'm pretty sure he doesn't believe her at all. I think he knows that you know she's not quite right there. But uh, he lets her on his show anyway. I guess he's some sort of Christian or something like that. And then there's like aliens theory comes into it, and it's just it's just absolutely bizarre. I, and it's just like you know sometimes you find yourself falling down a rabbit hole on the internet, and I was like, what is all this about? So then there's more, you know, these links. And eventually, <laughs> quite handily, uh, this person links to me how to buy the Kindle book Interview of the Devil by Sherry Schreiner, who either is not all there or is just doing this to sell books. You know, who knows? And so obviously this person has read this book. He's a follower of hers or something like that. And they genuinely, well, presumably genuinely believe that... <laughs> three out of four people have been replaced and these aliens are actually you know demons or something oh, it's just what is going on so anyway I just wanted to show you that sometimes you get unwanted attention or comments and it can be a little bit strange I have actually got something a comment which led me down another rabbit hole which is far worse than this far more disturbing I don't know even if I should do a video on it because it's just very odd. I will quickly show you one other comment and this is on the video that I made which was um, just like a Halloween skit video I sometimes do Halloween skits and this is all to do with Alexa and it's set up in the kind of way that it's like how and it went evil um, and so I called the video Amazon Evil because it's just you know a bit of fun basically and then I got a spam comment on that and I realise that some people don't like the ethics of Amazon, big multi-corporations like that. Yeah, I get it, I'm not stupid. However, on a little Halloween skit video, was this comment really necessary? Amazon may well be the most evil company in America today, contributing to and not detracting from our homeless issues and deranged customer ethics. You are dying of cancer! You, mu you have just lost your unborn child! You have to care for your dying father! You are suspect of being unproductive, according to your colleagues. They have reported you. You are fired. Source the next web. What? You're a 10-year Amazon customer. You're an Amazon seller. You spend thousands a year. You've written hundreds of reviews. Amazon sends an email saying you're suspect. Your account is shut down. Source Gary Joseph. Amazon. No evidence. No trial. Just the luxury of being fat, dumb, and happy. Wow, seriously, get a grip, have a day off. <laughs> you, are, you are dying of cancer, Amazon hates you, what the f- Anyway guys, there are some interesting people out there on the internet and uh, you'll find a lot of them on YouTube and other social media. So. <laughs> Yeah, anyway, I'm off for a lie down, I think. <laughs> so I hope you enjoyed that. Like I say, there is another comment which I might delve into another time. Because it does go down a bit of a rabbit hole. And it is, I think, quite disturbing. But there's reasons that I think maybe other people might find it upsetting. So, you know, but, you know, do I care? <laughs> so guys, yes, it's October. So it's almost Halloween. So, you know, a really good month for me. I really like Halloween. So hopefully there'll be some more spooky videos. I realise that wasn't massively spooky, but it was a bit crazed. If you've got any stories of things that happened to you, you know, let me know in the comments or whatever. Or if you want me to... I mean, I could do a video. I could do, you know, five weird comments. But you'd have to let me know what they are down below. So guys, if you like that, please click like. Make sure you're subscribed for more videos like this, and I'll see you on the next video. And until then, remember, three out of four humans are not humans. Okay, bye. Guys, if you're still here, you're awesome. Uh, but as you are still here, why not check out some of my other videos? 
Oh, and if you haven't already, please click subscribe. Laters, haters.